All right, we're going to show you how to install this Ring doorbell and set up the app on your iPhone. All right, so I want to put this, I guess, right about here. I've already got a hole right there that I could use. And so I might as well go ahead and do that, right? I mean, why drill more holes? And so I'm just going to go ahead and put that one in. It's going to save me a little bit of time, right? Let's see if I can get a better angle on this so you guys can see all right, so I'm just going to set it nice and even with the side here, and I'm just going to put it in there. Yeah, and that's on there. Good. Now I just got to screw this in, one here and one here. So now we've got to put uh, a drill in there. All right, so I think I'm going to go here. That should be about right. Let's go ahead and get her in there. I think we're ready to go. So this is about right where we want it. And let's go ahead and drill our other holes. Whoops. Okay, we should be good. So now we just gotta put our screws in. Let's go ahead and get this bottom one in first. Oh, that's not good. That's much too, I think we did it, we, we made a mistake. So I tried to use the screws from my old ring doorbell. They were too small. The ones that they gave me with this new one were thick and fat and they worked well. You'll see in a second. All right, so let's go ahead and get this one in here. So I put one of the big ones up top, as you can see, and now I'm putting them in the bottom two holes. And I'm using my Phillips head instead of the driver, which is a little bit easier. We should be good. The thicker screws that came with the new ring doorbell worked much better. Bam, done. One more, and last but not least. This one's too loose, because these were the, I tried to use these screws from the old one, and they're too small. So I've got to go ahead and get one of those thicker, bigger screws that uh, came with this specific one. Luckily, these are bigger and they should be much tighter. There we go. Oh yeah, I can feel it biting. All right, let's get her in there. Bam. All right, so now this is really strong on there. So to put our, um, our ring on, you're gonna start off with the back right here. You see this? It's gonna catch on this little lip right there. You see that right there? Let me give you a bird's eye view of it. So up top here is this little catch. So the very top of this catches on that, right? So what you have to do is just kind of set it on there like that, and then just push it, and it's on. That's it. Now to get it off, it's really simple. You just pull, bam. And to charge this, you've got to plug it into your USB, right? So it's already charged, so we can just go ahead and set it on there like that. And bam, Bob's your uncle. Now we've got a brand new ring doorbell. And I'm going to take the old one, and I'm going to put it on my garage door. <laughs> okay, so when you get your ring, you're going to find these weird-looking screws in there. You're going to find this weird tool. It's like a star kind of deal, doohickey, which not many people have. Uh, if you have a ring doorbell, you get one of these with it. This is a security device, and what we're going to do is, after we've mounted it, which we have, we go and we screw one of these underneath that, and that means nobody can pull the thing off of the mount that we have it on. So we're gonna do that right now and show you how to do it. Okay, so if you look at the, the ring itself, um, and you come underneath here, there's a couple little screws, and that's where you put this, and then that locks it on there so nobody can just come and pull it off, you follow me? So let's go ahead and do that. So first of all, you have to have this tool that they gave you with <laughs> the ring doorbell. And what you're going to do is you're going to take one of these security screws that they gave you right here. See if you can see it. You got to screw that in with this device. So we're going to come under here. We're going to put, we're going to go ahead, shove that in there like that. You see that? And I'm going to come up under here. I'm going to find that hole, push it in. I'm going to go to, I'm going to turn it to, I'm going to turn it clockwise. So I'm going to the right, righty tighty, lefty loosey, right? I'm going to put it right in there like that. You see that? And I'm going to come up under here, and I'm going to find that little hole, push it in, and then I'm going to go to the right, to 
just like that. I hate my, I got my big thing, fat fingers in the way now. Alright, we're good. And now if I pull on it, bam, it ain't coming off. Alright, in this video I'm going to show you how to remove this from its base that you've installed on this wooden frame and uh, so that you can charge it and how to charge it. So we're going to take it off and get it charged. Uh, to do it, you're going to need this tool that came with your kit. You see it's kind of like a star tool and that's going to take off your security screws at the bottom. And you definitely need this tool. If you don't have this, you're going to have to buy one from Home Depot. All right, if you've installed your ring doorbell properly, you put in the security screws on the very bottom so nobody can steal it. So what you have to do is uh, release those two screws, unscrew them. That means you're going to twist uh, to the left or uh, counterclockwise, righty-tighty, lefty-loosey, pull them out. Don't lose them. Put them in your pocket or in a little plastic bag or something because you're going to need them if you want to keep your ring doorbell safe. I mean, you could leave it on there without the screws, but then somebody could just grab it. So let's go ahead and let's unscrew that other one. We're going to go uh, lefty-loosey, if we can get it in there. Yeah, well, there it is. And yeah, there we go. Now we're just going to unscrew that one. Once we get that unscrewed, then we can pull the ring doorbell off very easily just by tugging on the sides and up. So make sure you don't lose it. <laughs> so I got my fingers on it, holding on to it. There we go. See it right there? All right, so now we can go ahead and just grab the, the ring doorbell and pull it off and take it in and charge it. It's just going to pop it off, lift it up, and bam, Bob's your uncle. There's the port right there. All we got to do is get one of those Android USBs. Put it in there, put it into the uh, 110, and charge that baby overnight. It'll be ready to go next day. All right, let's do it. What you're going to do is you're going to come to the very back, and right next to the screws is a port for one of those USB to, like, Android phone type of ports. So we're just going to plug it in there and plug it into a block and let it charge overnight. That's what we're going to do. All right, I'm going to show you how to do that. If you look here, I have one of these types of plugs and I have it plugged into this block right here, as you can see. All right, so here's our ring. And all I've got to do is plug it right into the back there. So I'm going to take my plug, as you can see, my USB to whatever that is, Android, I guess you'd call it. And you look at it, you can see the uh, curved sides on this side, right? So you want to match that up with this one here. And then all you have to do is just plug it in right there. We still want you, want you guys to be able to see me do it. Bam, done. All right, now we just gotta let it sit and charge. You can see the light just came on, and that's telling me that it's charging. All right, put her over here, and we'll just let that bad boy charge. All right, so our ring doorbell is fully charged. The way you can tell is this is completely solid. So now it's ready for us to put up on the, uh, on the door. <laughs> Let's do it. So the very top of this catches on that, right? So what you have to do is just kind of set it on there like that, and then just push it, and it's on. That's it. Okay, so if you look at the, the ring itself, um, and you come underneath here, there's a couple little screws, and that's where you put this, and then that locks it on there so nobody can just come and pull it off. You follow me? So let's go ahead and do that. So first of all, you have to have this tool that they gave you with the ring doorbell all right and what you're going to do is you're going to take one of these security screws that they gave you right here see if you can see it you got to screw that in with this device so we're going to come under here we're going to put we're going to go ahead shove that in there like that you see that then i'm going to come up under here i'm going to find that hole push it in i'm going to go to i'm going to turn it to i'm going to turn it clockwise so i'm going to the right righty tighty lefty loose all right I'm going to put it right in there like that. You see that? And I'm going to come up under here. And I'm going to find that little hole. Push it in. And then I'm going to go to the right. Just like that. I hate my, I got my big thing, fat fingers in the way now. All right, we're good. And now if I pull on it, bam, it ain't coming off. All right, I'm going to show you how to set up the app on your iPhone for your Ring doorbell. If you don't already have an account with Ring, you're going to have to set one up. I'm not going to show you how to do that. I'm just going to go ahead and log in and open her up. Set up device. I'm going to do doorbell. And now I've got to scan a QR code on the Ring device. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. The QR code is on the back of the Ring doorbell itself. All right. It's asking me to access the camera. I said yes. 
Okay, there it is. And bam, got the QR code. Got it. All right, it's detected. Continue. All right, I'm just going to call it front door. Caution. If you use the wrong screws to secure the ring doorbell, it could damage the battery. Yeah, okay, got it. Got it. All right, we, I have found security. I have found security screws. Okay, got it. Remove the protective film. Okay, got it. Next, grab Wi-Fi password. Okay, continue. Would like to use Bluetooth. Okay. Two-step. To continue your setup, enable Bluetooth. You may have to go through all the steps again, you know what I mean? Go back, go back, go back. Next, okay, let's let's turn on Bluetooth. <laughs> Maybe Bluetooth's not on. Bluetooth on. Okay, Bluetooth's on. Let's go back to the to the thing. Let's go back again. Remove protective film. So now I, I think I've got a is there any protective film? I think I already removed that, didn't I? All right, so let's go. Okay, I'm gonna, let's grab the Wi-Fi password. All right, so next grab your Wi-Fi password. I gotta get that. Get close to the ring doorbell. It's important to be close as possible to your device when setting up. If you're still having trouble, I am near the device. Press and release the orange button on the back of the doorbell. Oh, I'm so stupid. This one right here. Oh, there we go. Okay. Light is spinning. Doorbell is preparing for setup. All right, so <laughs> probably good to be reading this stuff. Connecting to your ring doorbell. When prompted, connect the ring Wi-Fi network. Okay, so I've got to join that. Join. Got it. Ring wants to join. All right, it's probably going to ask me the password, which means I got to run upstairs and find it. Hello. Now connected to the Ring app. Okay. Now I got to get the password. All right, hang on. I'll be right back. Okay, so I got it. All right, connecting to Ring doorbell. Here we go. Connecting to Wi-Fi. Maybe grab a coffee. <laughs> Set up successful. Oh, wow. All right, continue. Just a few steps left. Okay, that's good. Continue. All right, so let's go just put this on the front doorbell and see what we see. All right, so here we go. Put her on. Now all we got to do is uh, check out our app and see if looks like I got something. Check out the app and see what's going on. Shut the door. All right now the question is, is it gonna work? <laughs> I don't know, we'll find out. Already installed it. Skip for now. Skip for now. Let your existing chime alert you when the visitors arrive. Skip for now. Let's make motion work for you. Let's skip for now. All right, I'm done. All right, let's see. Device is offline. Oh, there it is, check it out. Here we are. We are golden, we can see everything. All right, if you like this video, subscribe to my channel. It took me forever to get this thing to work. Peace out.